hi everyone welcome back in today's video i'm going to be showing you how i cook my rice and beans but before we get started if today is your first day or first time of stopping by a warm welcome to you and please don't forget to follow this page like share and comment to be notified whenever i upload a new video and to my returning subscribers a very big thank you so let's get started to begin, add in some water into the pot, cover and bring to boil. Once the water is done boiling, add in the already washed beans. Yeah, I wash the beans so stir and start to cook until it is tender or you can add in baking soda or account to fasten the cooking process. Let's check on the pot. So after 30 to 40 minutes, yeah, as you can see now, the beans is already soft. So next, I went ahead and drained out the water. So once I'm done, I will set the beans aside. Now it's time to parboil the rice. So in another pot, add in some water, cover and bring to a boil. Once the water is done boiling, add in the rice give it a stir cover and let it cook for like two to three minutes yeah exactly two minutes now drain it out drain out the water and uh, pour some cold water or need to stop the cooking process and set aside next in a clean pot add in some vegetable oil and allow to heat up once that is done heating up add in some salt then add in your chopped onions, fry for like two to three minutes. Two minutes now, I added in my thin fresh tomatoes, give it a properly stir and fry for some minutes. So next, I added in my tomato paste, mix to combine, fry the tomatoes until the oil floats the top of the sauce once the tomato is done frying i went ahead to season with some curry powder garlic powder and ginger powder so next i added in my oregano and white pepper i added in season cube my curry fish then give it a properly stir so next i added fresh pepper and give it a properly stir next i added my parboiled white rice and parboiled beans i'll go ahead to mix everything together until they are well combined Once I'm done mixing everything together, I added in the mean stock, stir until it is well combined. At this point, you can check for salt if needed, okay? Once I'm done mixing it, I top it up with some smoked catfish. Yeah, I went ahead and covered it with some pepper foil before covering it with lid. Yeah, set your stove on a medium heat and cover the pot and allow it to cook until the water has cooked off. Keep checking on it from time to time because rice and beans have a tendency to burn. Now let's check on the pots. Yay, our rice and beans is ready give it a gently and lovely stir and turn off the heat it is ready to be served and it can be served with fried plantain chicken fish or in whichever way you prefer yeah the smoked catfish that i use in this recipe 
took this food to another level honestly it tasted so super delicious and the yummylicious hope you find this video helpful thank you so much for watching we have come to the end of today's video see you on my next video remember bless bye